In this tutorial, we will be showing the process of logging into your portal and registering for classes. We'll first begin on the Bergen Community College homepage at bergen.edu. In the top right corner, we'll click my.bergen.edu, or you can directly put this into your URL, and then enter your username and password. If you are unsure of your personal information, you can go to A205F to the help desk in person and they'll be able to give you your username and reset your password. To the left, you'll see My Week. This will show a list of your current registrations and when you scroll over each class, it'll give you the time, location, and professor's name. In the top right, you'll see all of your Bergen links the Sydney Silverman Library, the Bergen Facebook, YouTube, class cancellations, portal help, and your student email link. In the middle, you'll see my Bergen email. Below that will be Bergen announcements, news and events, and my to-do. To the right, you'll see my class sites, which is linked to my to-do. My class sites is Moodle, which is a supplemental website professors use to post the syllabus, assignments, and videos pertinent to the class. For the purposes of this video, we will only be using Registration for Students under Web Advisor for Students. However, under Web Advisor for Students, you can also find financial aid information, your financial aid award letter, class schedule, your GPA calculator, and other important information. First we'll be clicking on registration for students, then search backslash register for sections. We will enter the term and for the purposes of this video we will be looking for a classical piano class level 2. Classical piano is under the subject of music Then you enter the course number. In this example, it is MUS231. And then enter the location. Hit submit, and all of the available classes will be listed. In this instance, there are no classes available because all of their statuses say closed. You can only register for a class that is open or waitlisted. However, if you waitlist yourself, there is no guarantee that you will be seated in the class. To the right, you'll see location, meeting information, time, room number, professor's name, and available seats in the class. When you find a class that you prefer, you'll hit select and submit. When you come to the register and drop sections, you'll decide on which class you prefer. Go to Actions, drop down box, Register, and remove any other pre preferred sections listings. Then you will hit Submit, and your classes that you've registered for will be under current registrations. Once you have registered, you will receive an email about financial aid, payments, and when registration will be closing. If you fail to pay, your classes will be dropped. If you are unsure of any other classes that you need for your program evaluation or that will fit your program, you can go to A118, the Center for Student Success, Academic Advising, and see an academic advisor to help you read your program evaluation. Once you know what is needed for your program evaluation, you will be able to register on your own like so. If you would like to see your schedule, you go to Academic Profile, My Class Schedule, select a term, and hit Submit. 
All current registrations, as well as the one you have just registered for, should be listed. 